this isn't it's supposed to be iCarly, carly but it is apparently now okay <laughs> all right apparently we're i carly all right so welcome to New podcast well, welcome, well oh my god <laughs> <laughs> well, 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 we well welcome to the late night hearth everyone um well, i'm gonna go around i'm gonna i'm gonna call i'm gonna do a little ro- roll call so so people know your voices for this podcast um casey say hello hello jason hey ryan yo dan i'll swallow your souls no that was satan <laughs> yes, I asked for Dan, Demon, if you would please stop possessing him. <laughs> Not Cringe Lord, it's 555. <laughs> <laughs> Dan, go, go ahead and give us your voice. Right, sorry. Uh, I am Dan. I'm back from the grave. <laughs> All T- right. Tony? Stop, dude. I'm totally and, that late. And Brandon? Ah, uh, yes, the negotiator, General Kenobi. Oh my god. <laughs> Hello there. General Hello there. Hello there. World shorter than i expected uh, <laughs> Jedi scum. i believe I, I believe brandon actually brought a special guest on sayori go ahead brandon introduce us to sayori hi sayori oh my Good god sayori. <laughs> so he just took sayori's I, i'm not gonna go ahead with that joke yeah, please don't. i was gonna i was gonna make a joke that referenced something that happens in the game um, um hi guys it's oh my god me. oh my god he's actually doing it <laughs> he's doing it he's doing it <laughs> i'm not gonna fucking do this shit. <laughs> i was gonna say holy shit all right casey how was your week that's very interesting casey i'm so glad that that happened this week <laughs> it seems, it seems the government I drones lied. have got him he is he is lagged <laughs> His lag was so bad he missed the entirety of the question. What happened? Casey, how was your week? Oh, it was okay. It was okay? What'd you do? Well, we started school, so I... Yeah. Uh, frantically reading... ...being and working on so, school. So I have a question for you. With, with um, all this virtual online classes... Are you planning on getting your Wi-Fi fixed? No. Damn. Oh, That's have cool. fun failing then. I think my Wi-Fi really only peaks when I'm on podcasts, really. Yeah. Are you sure it's not the government? The government? It's definitely the government. <laughs> Me. Me not. <laughs> oh pretty God. sure they're trying to censor him out as we speak. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the government is just saying, uh, he knows too much, we must stop him. That didn't Did- MIB. Dan, can we get can we get a, can we get your impression of a demonic government agent trying to stop Casey? Corrupt a child. <laughs> all right, Kill them all. Thank you, Dan. No, no, hang on, hang on. Do it. <laughs> Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. your anger. Do it. Do it. Sure you what, will when, not. When, the em- when Emperor Palpatine, when Emperor Palpatine enters a church, pew it. Oh my. <laughs> That's probably true. Uh, I'm pretty sure Ryan is the, is like one of the only people who I know who uh who talks to us in his in an, in his own podcast through chat. Yeah, I know, I know, right? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I he's think... in his own he's, he can literally like talk to us. You don't have to like type it in the freaking podcast chat, bro. <laughs> I guess he doesn't want to interrupt. But I think not... he doesn't want to interrupt, but also I think he's trying to make an active chat, which God bless him, right? But it's a podcast. Chat. It's a podcast. It's, it's it's all of the above. I'm really trying my hardest this episode not to interrupt anyone. And I do want to get chat active. Okay, Tony, I see how it is. He just spammed Neko G in chat. <laughs> there you go. Active chat. You're active welcome. Chat. Go Let's fuck go. yourself, Tony. <laughs> All right. So, Jay, how was your week? Uh, it wasn't that bad. I yeah. mean, nothing much. I mean, just working. Uh, I started college. You know, um, classes aren't that great, but it is what it is. You you mentioned you had uh you had one hell of a math teacher. Sorry, say that again. You said that you had one hell of a math teacher, right? 
Oh yeah, very very strict lady. Uh, I gotta like record like I gotta record myself like taking quizzes, which is understandable. But I gotta like take pictures of my homework, send let like, send all my work I show for credit. It's Interesting. crazy. It's crazy. I, I'm if I had her, I would be very tempted to just bring out Microsoft Paint and do all my work on Microsoft Paint. Oh, but that'd be funny. I also I gotta <laughs> use Proctor U, which really I I'm, hate Proctor. There's no way I'm installing it on my computer. So, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna use my mom's Mac. Yeah. I'm not doing that. <laughs> so <laughs> Mac Omega Lol. So if I, if I if I may say something about Proctor U, because I got a story about Proctor U. Ooh, oh, boy. Um, so <laughs> I tried installing it on my PC. This this old piece of steel right here, right? And um. Yeah, it, it installed, but it refused to work. Like, my PC was like, something's not right. I can feel it. Like, <laughs> it wasn't having it. I swear my PC has sentience at some point. So, like, it just wouldn't work. Like, there was nothing I could do. I had four tech supports that did it. I Okay, it was for my final exam in philosophy. So, it was stressing, right? I was on a time limit. And I was like, oh, it's due by midnight tonight. I'll start at like five, right? Mm -hmm. Because I have three hours. That gives me an extra two hours in case anything happens. I've had four tech support people and it took them five to six hours. And they all quit on me before they could figure out how to actually fix the problem. So I ended up having to grab an old lap like my aunt's laptop do it there and i emailed my teacher saying hey um i uh i can't do it tonight can you extend the time he was nice about it he said yeah sure and then i'm taking the quiz and it kicks me out early bruh, bruh. but that's because i i have extended time and i guess <laughs> i guess they he just never notified Proctor you, so it kicked me out early. And I was like, I would have gotten like these few questions if I wasn't kicked out early. And he's like, you know what? How about this? And we were we were going back and forth on possible solutions because he didn't want to proctor me for like for like another half an hour, right? He didn't want to like sit in a call with me and. and for another half an hour. So what he did, he's like, listen, I'm going to send you a question and I'm going to give you 10 minutes from the time you start writing your answer to do it. So I told him the time that I started writing my answer. I did it 10 minutes and I luckily, I luckily, I luckily got the question in. But Proctor U is, is full of shit. It's so bad. It's so bad for students. I don't like it because it controls your whole computer. Like, I, yeah. I got sh sensitive shit in there. I got all my, like, porn and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah that's not Tony's bro, computer. Bro, that, no, that was... No, actually. Oh, the... my gosh. Imagine if it was on Tony's computer. <laughs> oh, my God. Tony, <laughs> Tony. the FBI not. <laughs> Tony, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure your computer does save the cash for all those Discord commands you use. Probably does. <laughs> Do I really care? No. That's fair. Oh so, my God. Upward. so oh, yeah. One of my classes has Proctor U. I feel and so bad. It's, it's my it's my econ class. I fucking hate it. I, I feel like it's gonna be a fine semester if you have virtual classes, and it's gonna be a rough semester if they all have Proctor U. <laughs> <laughs> well, luckily, only I think I think only math. Math's the only yeah. like, serious class. Like I don't, don't want to say serious, like. It's direct, I guess. Yeah, I have um, I have some pretty chill classes this semester, but I'll yeah. get to them later. Yeah, um, like the rest of my classes are all on Canvas, which is nice. I, I yeah. like it like that. So uh, Just using my lab IT. Fuck that yeah, shit. yeah. Wait, are you taking a uh, Cisc one ten? The no, oh, you you guys are okay, both taking it. I'm taking it. All right. It doesn't seem that bad. Yeah, it's bad oh. if you do it like in person because it's so pointless. 
Like, I, I took it virtually, so I don't even need to show up for lectures. Like, I don't even have virtual really? lectures. Everything, oh. I just do the assignments. The lectures um, are the most grueling part. Though. They make you waste so much time. Yeah, I know. That's why I didn't do it. Um, for, for those who are either just tuning in or don't know what we're talking about, we're talking about a class called CISC 110, where they teach computer science majors how to use Word document and PowerPoint. Um, you gotta, you gotta pay one hundred and sixty dollars to activate or like the yeah like, access to website. Is this? I so I got lucky. I had financial aid do it. So. Yeah, but it, I I did too. But it only gives you fourteen days. No, 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 no. Fi my financial aid covered the one hundred sixty dollars for the textbook. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I had I had leftover leftover financial aid for the semester, oh. so all of it all of it went into a bookstore voucher which is pretty great um i don't know why you guys get stuff off amazon yeah but also it's free if i use my bookstore voucher <laughs> oh yeah it's free. i wouldn't blame you for that but like for like other book stuff i yeah. even go to the bookstore get everything off amazon like i did yeah yeah that's fair we could just fair. get off the internet yeah also it's what? way cheaper to get it from any other site yeah uh, or you can just email the uh book author like what i do sometimes get lucky yeah or or, if, that never really... or or if you know how to speak another language just type in that book in the other language and like try to find the english pdf pirated into another language's internet oh <laughs> as a joke don't do that it's illegal don't do it illegal hold on okay and... i think i found something else sorry for interrupting uh i'm I'm browsing the Reddit of people of Walmart. I'm face palming right now, Tony. Yes. I'm face palming because why? You could have just DM'd this to me. <laughs> but go on. Hmm. Yes, I could have done, but your boy has not been focused this entire night. But I'll save it. I'll save it for the segment. Okay. Sorry for interrupting. Continue. <laughs> By the way, one really quick um, thing: Are donations on? Um, so I don't have any alerts on for the podcast. Damn it! Did you did you donate? Thinking no, that was asked in chat. Yeah, I know, but did you donate? Yeah, check, check that... your donations. That's uh, all I'm gonna say. Oh my god! All right. That's like sixty nine cents. I'm calling it. <laughs> uh, you can't donate 69 cents, I'm pretty sure. Aw. Um, where's my event list? I'm an editor. <sighs> I hate... <laughs> Alert box library. Is this it? This isn't it. This is not it. I'm just gonna start clicking on things until I find the right one. Dashboard! This isn't it either. A studio mode? Um. Studio mode. Oh, shit. That's not... No. Uh, no. That's how to get help. And that's log out. I know not to press that one. Um. App Store. Themes. Alert box. Editor. Hey, why is there so many shit-related co uh, pieces of content? On this subreddit, uh, because it's it, a shit cause, reddit. Because uh, no, no, I mean, because people are literally shitting themselves oh at God. Walmart. Someone stepped please, in please, shit at Walmart. Please, please, no, let's not go there. All right, it's bad. In the meantime, yeah. while I try and figure out where the hell my donation thing is, because it should be here, and and <clears throat> Streamlabs loves to change things on streamers about every two months, um, so. In the meantime, Ryan, tell me about your week. Hold on. Mine was pretty much similar to Jason. Started classes. Um, I had one class today that's actually on campus. Um, sort of. It's like a hybrid. I'm taking a TV studio, video studio production class. And I had done this previously. I did this in senior year with just a, you know, TV and production so it was kind of like getting back into like understanding the equipment like cameras 
the soundboard and all that stuff. I think it's a sound pad. Okay. No, not sound pad, Jason. I'm not you. <laughs> all right. That was a shitty roast. I'm sorry. Um. But yeah, like I had like. You know, just I'm taking statistics. I have. I've never dealt with statistics. My professor actually said to any of my musicians in this class, you're either going to get it really fast or it's going to confuse the hell out of you. We all know which one that did to him. <laughs> what does music have to do with statistics? Uh, I don't know. That's what I, that's, that was my question. Like, hey, what does statistics have to do with music? Ah, here we go. Oh, my God. $2.69 from... I'm not gonna say your name because I know that one, Brandon. <laughs> oh my god, is he, try is he trying to troll the stream? Yeah, he's trying to. He says, "I really love this podcast. Thanks for doing this, guys!" Excla exclamation point! Exclamation point! And also, you know what? Thank you, Brandon, because this brought to my attention that I actually did not have my feed showed up. So now I can call people out without the the stream being disrupted by the alert noises. So yes. this is nice. Um, so yeah. So you have statistics now, and yep. your, you, and your, your professor has said that it's related to music in some way. Take yeah. a wild guess on how it's related to music. Who joined? No, it's just... Okay, you see. What? See your oh my god, I'm hearing <laughs> Discord pings. <laughs> That's pretty on the phone. It would be a shame if I were to spam a chat right now. <laughs> it would be a shame if I were to mute a person right now. Yeah, but I'm not the one. Yeah, I know. It's gonna go off. My thing's too laggy. <laughs> your thing is too laggy, Casey? Nothing my computer can handle this many people in one chat. Oh, that, shit. that can't be right. Guys, I'm too much. Oh my God! No, guys. Casey. Casey. Wait. Voice chat. Wait, Casey, guys. no, no, Casey. No. So... Oh, oh damn. <laughs> this... The, oh, the government worry. took him, guys. Again. 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 We have to. Yeah. We have to go on a search for Casey. God yeah. damn it! I'll Should I get out my Morse over. code keyboard? No, I'm sorry, I'm, sorry, I'm sorry, I will find Casey. I'll oh, send the best of the best. Yeah, Sayori. Welcome to their secret bonfire. Yes, now, here's, Say, here's... Say, Sayori will find Casey in the afterlife. Now, here's the thing. <laughs> we we would normally need a superhero to find Don't someone like this, but um, Black Panther would be good for the job, but I guess to segue <laughs> into what I was going to say. Did you just say um, White Panther? Panther? Yeah, no, hold on. Black Panther. Hold the fuck up. <laughs> So, I, I just got this news right now. Uh, Black Panther actor Chadwick Boseman died after a 43 year, uh, at 43 after four, a four year fight with colon cancer. Okay. What? R rip in peace? Why? why? I, don't, I don't know why, why are we mentioning this? Because I, uh, I just saw it happen I, and I felt like it was worth mentioning. Okay. Well, oh, um, I guess uh, F in the chat. Or the person who died. Oh, Tony, I was going to add. Damn. Like, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's sad. I just, I first off, I never watched Black Panther. Oh, me neither. Uh, but it's still, it's still sort of pretty upsetting. It was really good. Uh, yes, the, the old forfeit. Thank you. <laughs> the for fun movement. For fun movement. Yes, the for fun movement. Hashtag if you know, uh, Ross Boomsocks. I have his merch up on my wall. Nice. Or fun Whoa. soccer. Uh, you know what? <laughs> moving on. Uh, moving on, Ryan. Uh, tell me no more about your. Tell me more about your week, Ryan. So, um, it's pretty much I just started classes. You know. Yeah. Getting ready to put in my two weeks at work on Sunday. Nice. Um, yeah. Finally. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, Are you still going that, back? Yeah. Um, but only for like a few months. Mm. Um, and then by mid spring, I'm gone permanently. Nice, um, nice. And then you're but, working you know, at a. I... At a. Go ahead. 
broadcasting internship, right? Yeah. Okay. Continue with what. If you want to know more about it, check out last week's episode. Did yeah, we really right? say man. way too much about it? Oh uh, yeah, I mean, there's <laughs> there's no episode up for last week. Wait, we never uploaded it, bro. Um, I still it's need still on Twitch. It's still on Twitch, but also I need to go through it because I'm pretty sure my email accidentally showed, and I need to find <laughs> oh, the timestamp. Yeah. Anyway, so I found out that um for my theater class, which is, I still don't understand why it's a requirement for my, uh, major. Uh, I'm pretty what sure. major? Communications. So, okay, I'm gonna make a point here. Uh, um, for, for every art student here, uh, they have to go through under, they, they have to go through some, uh, through something called AFO, which is Art Foundation. And no matter what your major, what major you're going into, uh, illustration, graphic design, commu- uh, communications, film, photography, you have to, you have to take this, uh, for the first year, and it basically consists of, uh, four classes, you get, you get two, uh, two of the AFO classes per semester, and then, uh, your other three gen eds, and then, uh, your art history and two gen eds. Yeah. So, that's pretty much what it is, um, even though it, even though it might not be, uh, something that you're going to be interested in, it's still going to be important because you are um, conveying something to the audience if you're doing theater. It's, yes. it's acting and it's basically just showing and uh, showing emotion, showing um, what you call it, conveying something. It's that's all I can really say about Wait, it. It's what just are we conveying. talking about? What class? Uh, um, he, has to, he has to take theater, theater class. Yeah, he has uh, to take well, theater. I, I took broadcast. theater. I mean, I mean, not really. I mean, in high school. <laughs> Well, it's not, you know, it's not like going up into the auditorium and talking Shakespeare. We're just like studying, like, I just think history of theater. theater. Talk, talking Shakespeare. I'm gonna, I'm gonna remember that one. I think we're all, we all are. Can I, can <laughs> I, can someone clip this? Talking Shakespeare so I remember to one day put that on a shirt. <laughs> I'll, I'll clip we're it. Not, we're not going... We're not going up on stage talking Shakespeare. <laughs> <laughs> One can only project Shakespeare. One can only project Shakespeare. Can I, can I talk about how the right side of the screen is is literally a color palette? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> the left side is literally just gray. <laughs> the right side is, is literally just gray, the color palette. You know what this is? Yeah. It's Raven's Bedroom, the color palette. That's <laughs> this is what it is. Um, I don't get it. Nevermore. Uh, Raven from Teen Titans. Oh, yeah. uh, I thought yeah. we were. Ta- I still thought we were talking about Shakespeare. Oh, wait. That's Edgar Allan Poe. Edgar Allan Poe. Wait, Edgar Edgar Allen. Po. Yeah, wait a right. second. And I thought I was the idiot. Look, man, I have my moments. All right. Nevermore. Bro, I Nevermore. I might do that. They're all on stream. <laughs> all right. Fuck's so- sake. But Close I found out that my, my uh, cock. <laughs> we're gonna cut that out later. No, we're not. No, we're not. <laughs> oh my god! All right. So, anyway, so Tony. I found out that. Oh, yeah. You know what? No, go go ahead. Go ahead, Ryan. I, I found out that um, my theater professor is the same one I had for my first communications class in my first semester last year, and she does not fuck around. Oh. Can I? And I'm like. Fuck. May I interrupt you with something that's completely off topic? Um, I'm pretty sure this is from this is from um, this is from three months ago, but I'm pretty sure it's still relating to the podcast. Someone I'm noticing this because it's on my my feed right now. Someone named Simp Boy sixty nine sixty nine sixty nine sixty nine donated a dollar to me. <laughs> That was like a while ago. Too. <laughs> oh that was like a while ago. I'm surprised you still have that. No, it, it shows me. It shows me my um. It shows me my uh. It shows stuff from two years ago on this feed, so I'm pretty sure it showed that. Yeah. Uh, <sighs> all right. So continue. You were talking about how how you have a hard. I'm done now. You can. Oh, okay. He has a hard theater yeah. teacher. 
Okay. Where, that's where we're ending. It's... Harder <laughs> does, does he Whoa. say erect the lights? No. Let's move on. Let's, this is getting yikes. This is getting Monka S. Um, Monka Toss? Oh, we already had uh, Monka Toss. <laughs> what's her name? What do you mean? The Sayori. Ah, Sayori. You already got that right. thing going. Sayori, <laughs> Sayori, can you come to the mic real quick? Uh, for those who are uh, uh, for those who only hear us because that's all of you, uh, Brandon has a Sayori doll that he just got and he's rubbing it ever so gently, aka you? shoving its face <laughs> against the microphone. Asthma? What? No, no. Wait, he has one. No, Brandon. Did yeah. I say Casey? No, you said Brandon. Oh. You said Brandon. Yes, I have one. Yeah, he has a Sayori doll. Hey Dan, I appreciate did, did the it, video did, you showed. Did it come with a? Uh, did it come with rope? Oh, <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no, it did not. Dude, yikes! Um, <laughs> to explain who Sayori is. Like... Uh, go ahead, Dan, if you if you want to. I'm pretty sure most of the internet knows at this point. Yeah, but go ahead. Who is it? Oh, oh he's no, asking you who don't is. know. Okay, I thought he wanted to explain it. Oh. Sayori, Sayori is a character from. Doki Doki Literature Club, which is oh a... I oh 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 I, I still need to play that like which, which yeah, you, yeah. Oh, do you know what happens? Spoilers. Do you know how? It's happens? one of those games that's in my library, but I have not touched because like I'm like I'll get to it then. Like... Uh yeah, I don't touch it because I'm like I don't want to get emotionally attached to things and cry. <laughs> For all of us, let's be real. All yeah, right, I'm going to show you. No no no, no, no we don't do we don't we don't do video cam here. We do not do video cam here. No, we're not. We're not watching streams either. Oh, I wanted to see it. Wait, well, wait, wait. Is it a stream of a video or is it a stream of him just showing his screen? It's just a photo. Okay, yeah, I'll take it. Yeah. Show us. If this is literally this is literally all it is. Yeah, I want to see it. This is literally all it is. I thought you were gonna show us the doll. Oh. Yeah, no, it's just, it's just, it's, it's just that. Yeah, the noseless wonder. <laughs> I should probably yeah. get a happier one. Um, That's fine. There this is go. gonna get TOS very yeah. quickly. <laughs> like, be careful with what, well, you, what also, you're showing here. Also, hold on, hold on. Do you have safe, safe search on? Imager. Um, no, no. Maybe. <laughs> oh. Uh, that doesn't worry, I'm not, like... I'm it's, not like it's fine. Do it. I'm yeah, not yeah. It anymore. Yeah. All right. So let's get to Tony's week. Tony, what'd you do this week? I really didn't do too much. I did uh, play, I did some work, played some games, uh, cooked. I actually learned how to make curry this week, uh, and I had my neighbor over, so that was really fun. Did uh, you? I, did you ever? <laughs> Did you ever get to say hi to those girls who slipped a note under your door? Yes, I did. Uh, oh. Actually, the person who came over, uh, I think it was a night or two ago, uh, so, uh, you know, was one of my neighbors. So I made curry for her. Uh, it was mostly both of them, but one had a work to do. Hmm. So I made curry, and it was good. That's interesting. Um, Tony had a date. No, he not had a really. He had a double date, but it was only him and two girls. <laughs> no. Oh my god. <laughs> hey, you want to be in a polyamorous relationship? To to <laughs> to Wait, what? Do you know what a polyamorous no. relationship yes. is? To to oh, yeah, yeah. Tony's oh, out. Eric is having a stroke, guys. Hold on. <laughs> Tony's out here acting <laughs> like a sub, but is really a player. <laughs> Stop yeah. it. Look, man. <laughs> hey, at, le at least I don't play like a sub on my assassins. Okay, but at least I play a dom on my tanks. Well, I also play a dom on tanks. No, you don't. Yes, I do. But I You're eat Italian one. subs. <laughs> Shut up, Brandon. No! <laughs> and oh, Dominic God. subs. Oh no. oh, no. Oh, no. Why did you say that? I'm an, I'm an Italian sub. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> It's true. He's an Italian sub. Can we get? Can we get a Photoshop 
of of, uh, of that's, that's a, an Italian yeah. sub with cat ears and a cat tail. No, it, it's just gonna be like it's just gonna be like an, a, a <laughs> regular Italian sub. With Italian sub. No, no, no. It's not gonna be that. It's just gonna be an Italian sub with uh, like you know the image where I have like the Wendy's hat on and like I'm just kind of staring menacingly and like the, the gun is photoshopped. <laughs> Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna put that on, like the the upper portion of the sub, okay. and it and it and it be within the bread. It, it's gonna happen. That, gonna that's happen. gonna okay. If I ever figure out the program that'll give us bouncing avatars on screen instead of Discord boxes, um, because I might be writing that program this semester. We'll find out. Um, hmm. uh, Tony, uh, that's gonna be your avatar, and I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> Speaking of uh, making things. Uh, the other guys didn't get to see the logo that I did uh, yeah, in the podcast. I was about to mention that. Yes. Do you see? Do you guys see the new logo right there? I'm looking at stream. Oh, is yeah, it? that's right the there. new logo. Where? Yeah. On stream right now. Yeah. If you're watching. Oh, stream. Oh, let me check. You don't have stream open? No. I do. I just have this Ah. Uh, I have it open because I I can mute the uh, stream. Yeah. I muted the tab, not the stream, so it still counts. Wait, if you mute the stream, it doesn't count as a viewer? Uh, I'm pretty sure that's how it used to work. Oh, interesting. Twitch is dumb. Twitch is dumb. <laughs> um, so, what do you guys think of the new logo? It's actually good. <clears throat> Thank you. I did, Brandon, I did nothing opinion. for it. Pay for me on what? Your <laughs> should... opinion of the logo. It's cool. It's, Thank you. This is the one thing to get out of these guys. So it's it's right. cool. Let's but you know what? I, you know what? I am gonna get out of these guys. Wait, did we talk? Did we talk to everyone about our weeks? Uh, we haven't yet. We haven't touched Dan. Uh huh. Okay. Right. Is it cool? We haven't touched Dan. We haven't. Yes. I don't. I, touched me I don't think we want to touch Dan. Rather, I think yes, we want to ask him how his week was. Oh my god. Uh, Dan. <laughs> All right, Dan. Tell us how your week was. Uh, pretty uh, average. I've um, uh, been playing a lot of uh, Warframe with this new update out. Mm. Ever, ever played Warframe? I have, and I remember that I, uh, I I grinded for like this hot blade knife thing. Um, and, and when I came back like a month later, because it was going to take like two days to craft, and like I stopped playing it for that two days, so I just waited until I played it again. Um, a month later, I came back, and the the blade was nowhere to be found, and I think neither already... were neither were the materials. I think I think if there were, I don't think. Okay. But well, sorry for you. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, I do enjoy it. But... It's a pretty cool ludum ludum shooter. Ludum shooter. Uh been playing uh, but other than that uh i've also been like uh playing some rpgs recently uh i've been em playing an emulation of final fantasy 5 nice it's that's pretty good awesome. that sounds awesome i um Which, I and also uh been playing this very obscure rpg at least in the west called dot hack gu which basically thinks sword art online but actually good i actually have that in my steam library i'm pretty Oh, dot hack gu. I'm pretty sure. If oh, if what? not, it might be on my Steam wish list. It's pretty good. Yeah. I heard like there were games before that uh, that were also that uh, just the original dot hack games, uh, which I really want there to be an HD remaster because oh boy, uh, are they expensive. Yeah, yeah. Because here's are the they... thing. The dot hack games are released uh, kind of like how episodic games are nowadays, like uh, you know, uh, they were released individually. Like uh, for the original dot hack game, it was released as four different separate games. Okay. For the fourth volume, it costs a fortune nowadays. And why is that? Because it is the rarest. Uh, because like dot hack, uh, when it was originally released in the West, did not uh, did not do that well. Mm. and that's like uh the only people who have the fourth uh part of uh, the original dot hack games uh are veterans and who are not willing to give it up for a low price that makes sense 
So, uh, besides playing video games, did you do anything? Um, got some new Warhammer miniatures. Nice, nice. nice. I, I've always wanted In, to get into Warhammer, go- but it seems like very expensive to do so. Yeah, like I've not, I've not gone full on making an army so far. I've just been, you know, just buying some models, uh, painting them, just hobby parts. Mm-hmm. Not really playing a game, really. Okay. Sounds cool. Isn't there a game mode that's like only five figures? Yeah, Kill Team, where basically you really only need like one box set and the rules, and uh, you basically have a miniature Warhammer game. Nice. Sounds fun. But for now, I think I'll stick to D&D. <laughs> oh, speaking of which, uh, I think it would be a good idea for all of us to do a D&D campaign. That'd be... I okay, do... so that'd be awesome, but I'm not sure if my time would allow it. I think I could be like uh, well. I really I really want to be I really want to get into being a DM. That sounds fun. I, I can I can totally see it. I, uh, I'm going to put in so many Final Fantasy references and it's. I'd be down for that, dude. Can I be Tifa? I mean, uh, I I was I was actually thinking more of the classic Final Fantasy, saying than more of the urban fantasy, but. I mean, hey, whatever works. He, wa- he wants to be Tifa, but he wants to be that feline race that's basically a cat girl. Oh, what? What was that? What was that race? Uh, I forget. Because I forgot they had. Hold them. on, hold on. I have the player's handbook right here. Let me find it. Like from Final Fantasy fourteen? No, no. From D and D. Oh, oh, D and D. Not Leonin. Because I think there are cat girls in Final Fantasy fourteen. Oh yeah, there there are. There are definitely. Um, chapter one, step by step character. Oh my god! Chapter two. Um, I mean, there are a, a race. Here it is. Races. Choosing a race. Uh, dwarf. Elf. Blah blah. blah I used to play elf. Uh, dark I would just elf, play elf. Halfling. Human. Listing off things that don't matter. Dragonborn. Gnome. Is this Elder Scrolls? Yes, no, this, is El- this is Elder oh. Scrolls. Just let him believe it's Elder Scrolls. Gee, thanks, asshole. Oh, no, it's not in the player's handbook. It must be an expansion. Yeah, it must be. Ex- of course you needed an expansion to get a cat girl character. It's always, it's always an expansion, isn't it? Yeah, uh, basically. Hold on. Uh... Expansion in my butthole. <laughs> <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Doing you dirt, doing you dirty with that uh for that money. <laughs> you know right. what Goatsy is? What? You know what Goatsy is? I don't think I want to know. Goatsy yeah, is no. pretty much what I just said. Go- oh, so that's what that video I showed oh, was. Oh my god! <laughs> no, please, let's not bring this up now. Do I do I have to start a new character? Oh my god. Speaking D&D of- Beyond, D&D Beyond just did something awful. Hey. What did they do? So D&D Beyond now limits the amount of slots you have for characters. Wow. I hate oh. this. Hey, you know what is you know what also is awful? What? Riot's fucking league client, which is oh. going to fucking segue us into our next segment. No, no, because you, you, want, you, wanted, you wanted to talk about something, didn't you? Me? Yeah. Before we went to Dan? Well, we oh, no, to no, I was, try, I was, try, I was trying to segue. Oh, uh, uh, okay, okay. Oh, have we not gone yeah, we to Brandon? Gone to me, oh. Jason, or... Oh, no, wait. No, we went well, to no, Jay. We, we did Jay. Yeah. Did we not do you, Brandon? No. Okay, okay, Brandon, tell us. You about don't your have week. to though. No, Brandon, tell no, us. No, we're about doing it. Also, we haven't done me. <laughs> okay, I just really want to let you do you. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do me. That would be kind of gay. <laughs> <laughs> no, that that's more like masturbation, but whatever. Um. Oh wait, I just thought of something. And it's gonna Definitely. be random, and maybe Jason will laugh at this. Who knows? Yeah. Um, because he's been silent for quite some time. Uh, but I remember this one time in freshman year, there was this girl in my advisory class. She yells across the classroom to me. 
She says, Eric! Yeah? If you had a gay, identical twin, would you fuck him? <laughs> Why? That is the most interesting thing to yell across the classroom. <laughs> yeah. And... I'll get back. I'll get back to my stories of advisory, but I want to touch on Brandon first because I had one other really funny story. I'll be right back. So, okay. so go ahead, Brandon. Tell us about your week. Tell us about you and Sayori's week. Oh, well, I guess really. Um, I'm actually more of a Yuri kind of person, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Um. You love that Yuri between Sayori and Yuri. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, so, my week was uh, pretty cool, I guess. Okay. What'd you do? Uh, I uh, got that base fixed. That nice. uh, black base that yeah. um, you t- we tried to clean out a while ago. Yeah, I finally got that fixed. Turns Are... out it's a couple of ground wires. I almost fell out of my chair. Damn. Um, the the um, uh, Electronics were like grounded correctly, so a bunch of ground wires like barely hanging on. So we just, so that got fixed. Okay. Um. So, I had uh, a bunch of days where I had to work late, like one time, like on Tuesday, my boss told me last minute, "Hey, we need someone for like a guard shift to stay here until ten o'clock at night." Sure, I'll do it. Whatever. Uh, that's rough, bud. Uh, I saw yeah. that you, or I heard rather, that you're planning on selling one of your bases. No, I'm selling a guitar. Oh, you're selling a guitar. Okay. Yeah, I'm cool. not selling a bass. For how if much? I'm like 150 bucks. Okay. Uh, do you want to plug your Instagram on stream? Be- because that's where people are going to see it, right? Uh, sure. I'll type it into the chat. Okay. It'll pop up on screen for those who are. Wondering and, I'll, and when it does, I'll say it for those who are just listening. Speaking of selling guitars, Eric, remember that time I told you? Um, or I don't know if I told you, but I remember uh, Brandon and Tony talking about it. Did I tell you about the time a lady tried to sell me a guitar while I was at work? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yes. What kind of guitar was it? It was an Ibanez. I can't remember which model. Um, but she was trying oh, yeah. to sell it for like nine hundred dollars, and I'm like, "Lady, and I, I could buy that for like two hundred and fifty dollars at Guitar Center." No. Was and... it like one of the crappy ones with like the crappy like e- EMG copy with pickups I and like think a so. shitty neck? I don't think so. Um, <clears throat> but I'm like, a, I can buy that brand new for two hundred fifty dollars at Guitar Center. B. I work at Tanner's. Where the fuck do you think this money's coming from? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I make nine dollars an hour. What the fuck do you think I'm making? Yeah. The whole things. So, so the the Instagram that I put up is BP Fister underscore official. So there you guys go. Um, is there any, yeah? Is there anything else you want to tell us about your week, Brandon? I was playing Halo with Dan, I guess, a lot. Oh yeah, we have been doing that. It was that was pretty cool. Okay. Thanks, uh, 343 for finally adding challenges to that game, so people can actually <laughs> level up a lot easier. <laughs> nice. Yeah, you can knock out an entire tier in like at least once a week. Now, what what is a tier? Is that like a level? Basically, you know what like, like, uh, Halo Reach's uh, character customization and how you have to earn them through uh, through credits and stuff like that? Uh, re- not credits, like requisition? Um, the first Halo I played was Halo 4, I'm sorry. Okay, you know uh, how... Okay, like, so uh, pretty what, much it's like a fuck? battle pass kind of weird I was thing. A po- like... I was a Pokemon kit, alright? I was a hard Nintendo kit. So was I that the first Halo Marvel. game I played I was Halo 3. Kid, I was a Call of Duty kid. I was I, a Warframe anyways. kid at one point. I, I played was. I played Pokemon and I played Smash. And I played those Wii Sports games. I played too much. I, then, I was a Wii kid way back in the day. Yeah. Like, I remember I had like a Wii with like 
mm. a bunch of cool games on it like this, da, 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 da. This, this may be my uh this may Check be con the games on the boys this, this may be con this may be controversial but brawl is still my favorite that's so, good that's, brawl that's good story mode brawl that's has an good. amazing brawl story good. mode i i love brawl like it was so fun ike was still powerful he still is Ike they they never nerf ike right so i get i get to play ike whenever i want um but i still love brawl it's so fun and the bad part of being like my first smash as me playing brawl was that i know how to use a wii controller sideways better than i know how to use a gamecube controller i do not know how to use a gamecube controller GameCube is confusing yeah, as hell. I don't know how to use that GameCube, GameCube controller either. GameCube is one of the best controllers ever made on the planet, in my opinion. Oh, here we go. Sharp beats the Hold on, guys, guys, guys. Ever made. I it still have saved. one. Guys, 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 guys. Jason, talk. What? Go ahead. They're talking wait. over you. Oh, wait. Yeah. Oh, I just... I, I thought you were about I to start have... ranting. Oh, yeah, what was I running? Oh, GameCube controllers. <laughs> GameCube controllers are so good. They're so comfortable. They're probably one of the most comfortable controllers that I, I ever owned. Yeah. Better than the you Xbox. Anything. It's so comfortable. Mm -hmm. I yeah, admire right. your opinion. However, you're wrong. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the best controller in the world is the Xbox 360 controller. No one can say otherwise. Xbox right. is a good 360 controller. Is good. I like it, but not better than the GameCube. Sure beats the hell out of the N64 controller. Oh, yeah. N64. Yeah. That was a train wreck. What the, what the fuck the were they thinking, man? They were thinking about everyone's third arm. <laughs> you know what? You know what? Some of these, some of these people in this next segment will might give you a third arm, but we, Tony, so, we still have not uh, done my week. I'm trying so hard to segue. Like, be forgetting. patient, let, boy. Let me segue. First off, I don't bring it up randomly, and second off, I have our task list basically in my head, knowing when we're gonna do stuff. By the way, the only other thing Keep that I've done me. this week. Ooh. Is adopt Sayori and Yuri. Ah uh, yes, you have adopted the doll. Do you have pictures of the doll so we can p put them up on screen? Okay, you. Uh, I feel like I feel like kind of um, uh, dirty talking about all this because like, oh man, a grown man who plays with dolls. So. I don't, I don't play with dolls. I just collect he collapse them. them. He's yeah. a strong. Like he's a strong, independent man, collecting his <laughs> dolls. <laughs> Hell, I got I got a flamingo, a stuffed flamingo for Valentine's Day. Hold on, I let, call him Salmon. Let me. He take, sits right next to my PC. Let me take a picture of this cute figurine that I picked up at a convention, and then this hopefully will make you feel confident enough to share with us. I don't know. I'm already sharing it. Oh, you are. Yeah, you oh, can, you can still send that though. I kind of want like an like, LNH. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, see. Look at that, guys. Look how adorable that is. It's, <laughs> it, it is so cute. That's what he's been rubbing up against the microphone. If you're an audio watcher, it's a... And also this one, which is my favorite, I guess. Yes, and oh. Yuri, which is very serious. Why are her <laughs> legs so long? No strings attached. No strings attached. Oh, my God, please don't. <laughs> Wait, how, how does this work? Yeah, um, I think I was thinking about giving Sayori to um, uh, Eric for Christmas. Nah. <laughs> nah. Eric's like, please don't. Give it to Ryan. No. <laughs> yes, I'll give it to Ryan. Give it to Ryan. I think no, Ryan. I'll just give it to then. I'll then I'll definitely give it to Eric. Oh and, then God, and then I'll just chew it up. And then I'll just give it to Brent. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's like a Mexican it. standoff with Sayori <laughs> plushies. <laughs> this is this is yeah. the figurine that I picked up at a con. It's oh, cool. it's a little desktopper thing. It has a reversible. What the hell head. you guys become such weebs? I am a weeb. A Eric's always been one. Yeah. B Brandon, I have no idea when the fuck that happened. That happened when I was introduced to him. It spread very quickly. 
What? Yeah, now I'm now I'm collecting the disease. What, <laughs> this... anime? Yeah, it's worse than COVID. Did I show you the Black Panther guy? The... <laughs> yeah, we, we already read the thing I just mentioned already... a little while ago. Jay, Jay, where have you been? <laughs> no, I thought Tony was like talking about like something else. I, no! I... No, like the actor just... Chadwick Boseman died. The, this is why... This is why I like having Jay on the podcast is because if you guys ever watched Steven Universe, he's basically yeah. Chad Paracha. Like he's uh, <laughs> he just tells us the past all the time. <laughs> God, yeah. So basically the useless bad, information. Mars. That's so sad, man. Yeah. No. It is I don't know how to respond to it though. I don't mm -hmm. because I wasn't a huge fan of his and I get if you were a fan of his, this is a very sad moment for you. And and death in general is just a sad moment. But I guess God bless his soul and hopefully he will... There there are like 10 people I know right now, as of this moment, that are crying their eyes out because, he, because of his death. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Uh, I remember... I remember was, what, didn't he become a huge idol, like, for a while? A huge yeah. what? Idol. For people, idol, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like to look really, up to. Uh, he's done some good things. Was he the one that paid for like everyone's college at some school? I don't know I don't if know. that's true. I don't know. Oh my he's god, he's done some good things. I know. By the way, about Sayuri and Yuri, yeah. I feel like kind of like weird because here, here I am, like a twenty-year-old man, like going on to like here <laughs> and buying fucking like plushies and like your point i mean i'm still reading comic books <laughs> basically i'm reading manga there's a lot i can say about this topic we could... i'm not going to so so basically <laughs> so i i think i'm gonna talk about my week now and okay. and if you guys have questions go ahead ask them while i'm talking i don't care um so Basically, I started my classes. I started college this week. Um, I, uh, I'm taking a Comp Sci 3 class, uh, which in the first class, the teacher has told me that he will, he, he says that everything we program in the class is our property to do what we want with, and he will, he will show us certain, um, certain platforms to sell software and games on. And this is the same teacher that I have for C++, orient, object-oriented C++, which is basically a fancy way of saying video game development, which is just a, a less fancy way of saying how to make video games. And if you don't understand the term how to make video games, I don't know why you're listening right now. <laughs> what? Basically, install a better brain. Install a better brain. <laughs> install a better brain. Ask Doctor Frankenstein. Ram. Ask, ask <laughs> France Frankenstein to do it for you. Ask Doctor Frank. Even though Download my dad's not a doctor. Ram. So. So. Eric, you, I, read, you read my mind. I wanted to make that joke so bad. <laughs> so. <Bastard. laughs> uh, you know, you just gotta act quick on them jokes, Ryan. You just. Let's you know, go I'm slow. Yeah. Aren't we all? <laughs> <laughs> Some days more than others. <laughs> yeah. So my I I've also been reading this new uh this new manga called um The Girl from the Other Side. New what? Manga. Oh. It, it's called This a, a Girl from the Other Side. And the premise is that there's this disease topical, I know, right? Um, there's this disease that only spreads if you touch someone, right? Doesn't spread by any other means. You have to make physical contact with the person and the disease turns you into a demon, right? Like this, this horrible demon creature or whatever. But the, but the book is about a demon who took in a child, right? A child that was not infected, but swore to protect her i guess because the insiders which are the people who are not infected and live inside a wall 
are going out and killing the demons or something, and they thought the little girl was infected, even though she literally has the opposite of what the demons have, because the demons are all, like, black and demonic and horns and basically a bird face. Um, and she has a oh. human face with white hair and a white dress. I guess she has black boots and black pants, but, like, still... She's not infected, and you can look at her and be like, she's not infected, but everyone from the inside is like, fuck, we think she's infected. Somewhere on her body, she's hiding it. We must shoot arrows at her if we find her in the woods. And this girl is, like, elementary school age. <laughs> like, she's, like, really little. And it's a really sweet story, is, is what it is. So... I give it a read. Yeah. That's basically been my week. Um, I'm just going to say, the, cook all, motherfucker. <laughs> the, uh, the other thing I've been doing this week is playing League of Legends with Tony. A, I wouldn't say a you lot. You do that every week, too. <laughs> but I do that every week. But, like, this week, I, I played, well, like, one day, maybe, or two days. Maybe. Yeah, you might want to go a little bit higher than that. But... <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yeah. This leads us into our next segment. Yes, the about, segue. <laughs> about League of Legends. Um, what the fuck is this? Yes, that is, the, that is the segment. What the fuck is this? That's the segment. Oh my god. Yes, what? that's the other Jason, segment. Jason, what the fuck did you send? Oh, what, what's going on? What's going on? Where? Activating cum hose. <laughs> oh my god. Please. Brandon, don't say that. <laughs> oh, is that the next stream. segment? No, that is not the next segment. <laughs> <laughs> but don't say that on stream, you dumbass. <laughs> come, 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 fuck. Please, please stop. <laughs> Tony. <laughs> Oh my fucking god. <laughs> god damn it. Okay. So let's what's it called? Let's get into the segment. Uh I think it was mine and Eric's idea. And uh, I worked on this with him uh two weeks ago because we, we were supposed to do it la last week, but we ended up up with three people. Alright. Oh my god, cool. I'm destroying everything. Alright. Um how am I gonna do this? Okay, what is this? What is the next segment? This next segment is called Roast the Champion from League of Legends because I know All right, I'm out. We hey, literally what? we literally made this for <laughs> Brandon and and Jason to just shit and on Casey. League of Legends. Yeah, and Casey. Uh, and me. Just to shit on League of Legends. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Like that's um, where is the... Cuz 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 I'll I'll be like I'll be saying something serious. We're trying to have a conversation, and Jay's like, "Oh, it's because you're playing too much League." I'm like, "Bro, okay, let's no, get it all, let's all get it off it's, our chest." It's, we it, all, it, it we all have our sim play too much. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Well, it gets really annoying. So this is why we made this. To have your bash at it. Um, so, it will be being streamed. So I, those I, who are not, those who are not watching the uh, a podcast. <laughs> On Twitch, should pro uh, probably should go ahead over there and uh, check it out. Just stream it on like. You'll be able to understand what these people look like. Uh, um, like real time, bro. Why does her? I am. I am. I'm just. I'm just adjusting things because. Wait, Ryan, did you say her? No, no that's a dude. Never mind. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sorry. I, I assumed like the long hair. Uh, all right, all right. We're already off to a We're great start. We're already off to a great start. Wait, hold on. I, I think just, I, I just... think I think a minute is not long enough for these guys to give their full roast. I'm gonna <laughs> give them two, two and a half minutes to go ahead and just go at this character. And this all isn't right. you, know, you know what? Just you know what? Shit. I'm actually I'm actually gonna go around and I'm gonna ask what they think the character does. Okay. No. Yeah. No. Why not? Uh, okay. Right, sure. I'm gonna go anime edge lore three two seven and the two <laughs> people and he swaps between light and dark, judging from the blue and red summons behind him. 
<laughs> oh my god. He's actually. <laughs> Dan, Dan, oh just Dan. describe the character. Dan, 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 you were, you were, no, no, we're, no, we're, we're, we're roasting. This is, a roast. this is a roast. This is actually hilarious because he's spot on with the fucking light and dark. Yeah, yeah no, except, that's what I'm saying that was a description, not a roast. Except they're just both dark, was, was but anime different versions of dark. 7X, <laughs> edgy anime, okay, yeah, they're they're roast. 7X, not a fucking roast. Yeah, no, Jason, no. go ahead, give me a roast of this character. All right. Uh, what can I say about this? Uh, what is, it looks like one of those, like, freaking, like, I don't know, like, those little kids games you play, like, um, uh, freaking... Yeah, because Giant Murder Scythe with evil eye, with, uh, <laughs> the evil eye from Soul Edge is for kids. Yes, it's that screams family-friendly like to me. <laughs> it's, like, only, like, I don't know. There's not much. It's just a. Uh, picture. I mean, just just roast roast the fucking champion, roast the oh, guy, sorry. not the game. Why does the freaking blade have like an eye on it? Like, what's the fucking? Because point it's that? alive. I'm pretty sure if I poked that eye, it would fucking flinch. It's fucking soul edge. And it's the cos the costume or whatever he's fucking wearing is so weird. Like, how does that not hurt? You see his like shoulder blade, and it's so, like it's like a sharp blade going so, into his like. Nipple. So so I can, <laughs> can can I explain his armor? Because uh, because I blade. because I am I I am the Lord Master of League and he Legends. Looks fun. And he looks like that uh uh not really. He looks like who's that guy from Mortal Kombat with the red eye? You have to be more specific. What's his name? No, it's the guy oh, with the Kratos. Kratos Kano is the Kano person. Kano. 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 So that was, was kind of close. I'm so, no, it's not. So I wanna, I wanna move on to the next champion. Uh, but oh, wait, Brandon didn't get oh I, I, I think I forgot who the next champion was, but I'm pretty sure know, I remembered. No, no, no. Let's fine. be real though. That so, scythe definitely has the eye of Sauron. So it. I'm going to explain the champion now. You guys have a free for all on these roasts. So if you have something, blurt it out. And if you don't have the time to say it, you ran out of time to blurt it out. Right. I tried so hard. <laughs> wait, 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 Brandon. So say something. <laughs> Brandon, say something before I explain what the just champion is. But in the end, it doesn't even. Wait a minute. Anymore. All right, MCR. MCR wait, is. Was. I was gonna say he doesn't even need to. He was singing an edgy song. <laughs> yeah. Which is basically, yeah. this entire champion. Okay. For his, so the his scythe looks like it's from Soul Eater, and it has the eye of Sauron. Okay. It, though. So. All right. Once you're done oh. explaining, I, I gotta get it all. I gotta work. Oh. All right. So this this champion, right, is basically um Edgelord Shadow Assassin who got a demonic scythe um that's alive, and the armor that you see on him is actually the demon slowly taking him over until he either turns into the right side, where the demon completely takes him over and kills him and takes his soul, or the left side, where he controls the demon and takes the demon's soul. Half of that is literally the background of Siegfried from Soul Calibur. <laughs> oh my god, Jay. This meme you sent All to we me just have, is amazing. Have have the hey, character. here's the next character. Oh, hey, look. It's, uh, it's um, it, oh, that person that... Uh, it, that, that that that's not a cat. It looks like it. That's a, it's that's that, actually... it's that chick that yep. um, Tony simps for all the time. Yeah, it is. Ari? It's Ari. Hey, like yeah. There you go. Shitting out fur out of her ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She just had a five layer burrito taco do loco taco from Taco Bell. Oh, local taco. You know, that's not she even got the roast. cinnamon crisps. <laughs> had, uh, Dude, that's not even the roast I want to use for this champion. Yeah, it's for a different one. Tony made for her. What? <laughs> so Tony no, made her shit. Like, the fur. The fuck you made the. I made curry. <laughs> he made Ari curry. Oh god. Oh god. The, the, the girls that he Whoa. had over was Ari and Ari too. You cut out there. I said the girls he had over was Ari and Ari too. Ari too. <laughs> Electric Boogaloo. I got a shit too. In theaters now. Uh, so Brandon, go ahead, rush this champion. So this is the person that um Tony simps for all the time. Tony oh. sends her money. Tony lets her step on him. 
Uh, oh all the tears we stopped kind of stuff. <laughs> this is you're roasting Tony. Dude, you're supposed roast. to roast the champion. The, you're, you're, oh, you're, the, you might as well. Roast the, the entire retrospect of the game is that I control this champion, so it's actually quite the opposite. I could see like Tony inviting a girl over, and they're about to do it, and, they're about to do it, and Tony's like, "Wait, put this on." And, like, <laughs> <laughs> and she looks like Ari. She's like, and she's like, "Wait, what? Just put what? This on." No questions. Bro, come <laughs> on. I could see that. I could see that. Man, wow. Oh my god. This turned into a Even roast, Tony. Put in the context. Yeah, it feels fucking bad, I swear. Alright, next champion. Oh, look oh at this god. one! Um, I wish Casey wannabe. was here! Casey Tiny needed to be here for this. <laughs> this is literally just Harley Quinn wannabe. No, it's not. Harley Quinn wannabe with a fucking A cup. No, I was gonna say, Jason, <laughs> this bitch is so flat that you can God. pop an ollie on her skate she under her chest. chest. Dude, yeah. you, you can practice your fucking heel flips on this bitch. Oh my God. I'm gonna say I wish, Tiny Tina during her edgy golf phase. I wish, I wish, um, I wish uh, oh Casey was here because as soon, I guarantee you this, next time Casey is on the podcast, I'm gonna bring this image up and this is what he's gonna say. Oh my fucking god. It's you know her. Fucking Jinx! <laughs> fucking Jinx! Let, let's clip that so we can have that for next podcast. But oh, I wanna yeah. I wanna I wanna point out that you can you can uh <laughs> fucking tie two nooses with her hair. Yeah. yeah. That's probably okay, why do you wanna know That's that? That's what Sayori did. That's probably what Oh god. god. <laughs> Uh, uh, Alright, yeah, next You did not hear that, sorry You did not hear that Next champion <laughs> Oh my god, I forgot he existed um, It's Tyler oh. 1 Guys, it's Tyler 1 The champion No, it's like fucking El, El Mundo shit Like, I don't fucking Why does he have a circular, um, like, health like that It's so, like uh, This is, I'm this is who I think I am <laughs> It's versus who I actually am. I'm going to say stripper Genghis Khan wielding a prototype version of those uh, Death Inquisitor lightsabers that's been around. Oh my God. <laughs> stripper Genghis Khan. And I bet he's hiding a solid three inches when he's like going off. Stripper We're Genghis Khan. We're definitely clipping that. So, We're definitely clipping that later. So, right. I'm, so all I'm going to say, I'm, all I'm going to say is. That every person who plays this uh, champion listens to hard bass on full blast while, like, literally just fucking. while flaming in chat, flashing think... their mastery icon, and they. Uh, they more than likely have a three incher. I think. I think you just defined what Tyler 1 is. Basically. Right. But instead of him being a th having a three incher. Hey, it's not a three incher, like it's three a solid foot. three incher. I bet. No, no he's a solid right. three foot. I bet he's three. <laughs> I think he's I'm super rock hard. Oh my god. Alright, where, where are you going? We're, that line. we're gonna go to the next one. Yeah. Oh my god, not this bitch. Oh wait, where is it? <laughs> it's, the oh, god. it's the worst skin oh, in all oh, of League of Legends history. God. This is the worst skin. Why is Tron this meets good? skin. Tron, Tron meets like royalty meets. Tron meets, Sword Art Tron, Tron meets um what's that one movie? There's people on Mars or something where the guy time travels to Mars. Mars, Mars, Mars meets moms. No, not Mar <laughs> Mar Mars. Mars meets moms. Really? No. Well, the, it's 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 a uh, it's a live action movie. Total it Recall. Like the, yeah, it Who's looked like it? the design. It looked um, like the designer for this was like trying to figure out like what they should do, and they're like, fuck oh, <laughs> it, let's just add. Let's just add anything. Let's just add what I, anything. Yeah. They're like, basically, they basically we'll just said, hopefully the under boob attracts the twelve year olds. <laughs> it's like cyberpunk, and then it's like Tron. Like I, I basically, it's, it's like a class anime, that's... and then it's like I don't know what the fuck. This this is Dark Souls, but it's but it's extremely on a budget. <laughs> it's budget Dark Souls. All right, I'm gonna get to the next champion. This guy. Oh, this oh, no. uh, I think we Johnny all know Cage that. meets Dan, whatever his Johnny name is. Oh. <laughs> hey, who's, who's the guy in his rear view mirror? Johnny Cage. <laughs> 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 
That's Lucian. That's Lucian. That's Lucian. Watch out, Lucian's sneaking up. No, hold. I, I want to point to... out. So he's actually the first. I think he was the first black champion in, in the game. And then they made a skin right? that made him white. No, but the funny no. thing is, the the first black champion in league. I'm I'm not trying to be fucking insensitive or anything. I find it absolutely hilarious that they gave him a drive-by ability. <laughs> That's right, his ult is a drive-by. I, I shit you not. Yeah, guys. Let's end. Let's end. Let's I'm gonna say, uh, um, Johnny Cage fused with David Hasselhoff, who just recently stole Cloud's Buster Sword. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's really accurate. It's like Cloud's Sword. What? He definitely has, like, a Johnny Bravo voice. Whoa, mama. He, even hey, has John he has Johnny Bravo's dance, too. Oh, oh yeah, he does! God. Wait, no, he does! His, dan his dance yeah. animation is Johnny Bravo's Do the Monkey With Me. Yeah, <laughs> maybe, maybe he, got that maybe very he talks like um, John Claude Van Damme. He talks like this. Damasia! He's very overly dramatic. He's basically, he's basically yeah, medieval Johnny Bravo. Yeah, he's medieval <laughs> Johnny Bravo. <laughs> Alright, see you later. Yeah. CJ, thanks bullet. for being on the podcast. CJ. What's, what's the next one? Alright, the next one is this. Oh my fucking god. Um, uh, oh boy. Oh, 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 the girl, no. You don't have enough what? money for your pizza. How are you going to pay for this pizza? <laughs> don't worry. I got a solid two-footer for you, but honey... Why don't you come no, to be in my bed? This I, is the girl Eric wishes delivered his pizza. I, I have. I'm, I'm pretty no, sure. No, I I'm don't because sure. I know I know who the cosplayer is. Yes, I think I, and I think you know okay, where this is going. Okay, just 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 like for all my observation of the League of Legends, it's it takes place in some sort of like you know steampunk fantasy sort of s setting. No. Why the nope. fuck? Okay, so. One of, so actually there are there is a anime world in League of Legends. There is a magical world in League of Legends. There is just yeah, a straight up desert. There is a it's monster scary. void. There is a a okay. Nor okay. Nordic Viking. There is a Freljord. Yeah, Freljord. There is a medieval area. There is a medieval tyrant area. There is a jungle and then, there, right, that, then there's a steampunk okay, okay, area. Okay, 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 but still, why the fuck is he wearing a modern day pizza delivery boy outfit? Because, because, because that's what skins wait, are. Wait, delivery boy. Delivery boy? What? I'm boy? I'm sorry. I'm delivery uh, femme boy. No, no, He's we're saying, we're saying the... boy. We're, we're saying fuck. boy because there's a cosplayer who did well, this. Yeah, I'm fully aware of that. Okay, let's, let's, okay, let's move on before this gets too awkward. Oh, I, I, oh, this is the one I've been waiting okay, to hear. Okay, okay. That's got, one got, hell of a part. Halo means. That's one hell of a part. part. <laughs> <laughs> this is Halo I'm means. Gonna say, like she's like farting. I'm going to say Imperial Guard propaganda from Warhammer 40k. Oh my god. I, 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 I swear, I was waiting for like some kind of ass comment. And you nailed it. You nailed it. <laughs> it, it looks like she just part. ate a fucking chalupa from Taco Bell. <laughs> Right, and that and also, she's like what, looking at the look like turn the fucking trees. Go away. Also, the trees are speaking Vietnamese, I don't, man. I don't know why, why this. Why is, like, why is this? That's obviously combat. Like uh, militaristic combat armor has high, have high heels. You know what's really funny? She's a mage. Why not? She's, she's a, a mage. light mage. Yeah, she's a light mage. Yeah. This is mage? the worst luck skin out there, but yet it is this the is a funniest worst skin one. for mage. So let's get to the next one because this one is just all around shit and it looks like Let's, she's taking a shit no, yeah so basically <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure uh, we actually have a couple good ones in here yeah. and i think demacia vice garen was one of those yeah. actually ah oh go. this is another good one. Oh. Uh, so edge lord just um, um, rejected just, final fantasy i'd say i'd boss. say Jin is an edge lord well dan what I, are you saying i'd say rejected final fantasy final boss yes <laughs> Because, like, just just put a platform on the right side of him, put a bunch of, you know, Final Fantasy uh, character sprites, uh, battle sprites, and you practically got the boss all set up. <laughs> Basically, if you don't know how to count to four... 
one. If you don't know how to count to four, good luck playing against this boss. I just realized that <clears throat> Jin has four hands in this gym. I mean, I don't know why he wouldn't. She looks like a god that That's everyone a just, no one wants to worship. This is you know, a man. Like, <laughs> this is a, a dude. dude. This is a dude. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, like, people like, would rather, is... like, when the uh, conquistadors came to this land of the people who were worshipping this character, they were like, yes, we will convert to Christianity <laughs> over wherever the fuck this is. <laughs> Alright, All right, let's move on. <laughs> Alright, this one. Oh, nice. Oh, um... Luigi's Haunted Mansion gone wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I guess, like, Scarecrow did a fuck ton of meth. <laughs> and then, like, he's like contorted his body and become like whatever the fucking hell this is. Well, I'm um, sure that's just what Scarecrow is in general. I'm he's gonna just a crackhead. I'm gonna say, uh, rejected Hellraiser Cenobite. This is my local meth dealer. <laughs> <laughs> Which, by the way, I don't have. I don't do any drugs. I don't do any drugs. We do not condone <laughs> the of that, like at all. The only drugs I do is oh, by, video games. By the way, this is what his voice sounds like. Brother! Yeah, that definitely on meth. <laughs> so it sounds like he's... Bro, to... He actually you have, to, you have, to look different. You have, to, you have to do the voice while inhaling. Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh. He sounds like... He's Brother! The way you did that made it sound like he's trying to join a black metal band, but just can't. <laughs> Hell, I can't do my scars from the pet without screaming. All right. You have to suck pretty hard in order to do that. No, you don't. Right. Just inhale and then, and, and, then and then close your. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, we're gonna move on. No one got that. Okay. Oh, this guy. Uh. Joker rising from the dead. No. Oh. This is the most cancerous champion in League of no, Legends. No, it's not. How the there hell? Is worse. There no. is worse. Every champion is hey, like hold this, on. This no. champion hold on. is like. Do you I'm remember? Not having nerfed him. Do you remember? ZZ Rot Portal on um on Space Aids. Dude, I I I can't. I still can't believe they got rid of that item. I I was uh, really upset. Whatever. Let's get back to roasting him. Um, is that Blackbeard yeah. on his left? Yeah, he's dead. I'm going to say, sense. guys, I'm going to say, uh, Garrus from Mortal Kombat 11 wearing some armor from Elder Scrolls, and he really hates music. <laughs> yeah. Wait, where are you going Look at the piece of paper he's stabbing. Those are musical notes. No, they're not. They're names. I was going to say, this but, is yeah. probably the edgy anime version of Pirates of the Caribbean, <laughs> uh, Dead Man's Chest. Yep. Whatever that movie is, like That's where they're right. like the fucking flying Dutchman. Dead men tell no tales. Yeah. Dead no, that's Bas not dead men tell no tales. <clears throat> Basically, this character, this whole thing is, um, his captain told him to kill sea. Mo I'm gonna sum it up with a voice line. He says, "Captains told me to kill sea monsters. Sea monsters told me to kill captains." That's that's basically his story. <laughs> so he's insane. No, he, he drowned, came back to life with the power of sea monsters or whatever, and now goes around killing ships. He was seduced by tentacle hentai. <laughs> or that. Yeah. Or that. He got, a or he got also an option. He got a tentacle right up the ass. And from the looks at it, he really hates tea. That... I, I never even noticed that was there till today. Tea cup. All right, next guy. Fine. Hello? Just it tastes like leaf. Oh, is, it, is it all? I don't yeah. think so. Oh, that is all. Oh, it, oh, it is. Yeah, it's I really Edgeboard again. I wanted more. Okay. Okay. Uh, I, I'm done with this. You're done with stupid this? Stupid level game. Yes, League of Legends is stupid. Well, I mean, we tried getting to play, and you're doing fine. <laughs> yeah. You can just say no, Brandon. I wanted to see more. No. Yeah, we'll we'll get we'll we'll show you more later. All right, so I think we can either end this off one of two ways. We can do Reddit, or we can talk a little bit. Oh right, I, I, I thought we're doing. 
I forgot we were doing Why not both? 30 minutes. Uh, sure. Oh, wait, we still have people as stupid, don't worry. We... I'm stupid, I'm stupid. We can. Do you want to? Yeah, sure. Your words. Uh, uh, I know, I know our DMs are not safe. I um, know that for certain. So, our, our DMs are fine? Yeah, they're fine. They're fine. If I get banned by clicking your DM, I'm going to be by the the, way, the only thing that's anything line, anime that's related like... is the fucking Sunwang tweet. Okay. All right. Go scroll up. Scroll up. Oh, J oh, Jay left for this one. What? Uh, the Twitter one. Twitter one. Yeah. All right. Let's do this. <laughs> Into hell itself. It's, it's, it's zombie. Now. It's. In there, that bounds now. What the fuck? Uh, you to, we have to have audio. I can't hear it. Yeah, can, can, you, can you, you need to stream. It? You need to stream it. Yeah, we... oh, Eric. I see. Hold on. All right. Share my screen. Oh wait, I. Oh, You're gonna hear God. yourself though. Eh. You know what? I I can open it up in Chrome. I'm pretty sure. Really? Yeah. What is that? Sayori, fuck off! <laughs> I dropped my mic. Sayori, no! <laughs> no, I, I just. I, I, Sayori, I just don't mic. jump! <laughs> Do a flip! Sayori. Do a flip! I don't wanna jump! Do a barrel roll! <laughs> Alright. Say, Sayori, don't hang yourself from Brandon the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so I can I can stream this from here. Got it. Cool. Sounds good. Okay. Sick. Um, let me get back to here. Share the screen. Bada bing, bada boom. Hey, a bada bing, a bada boom. So it's ba it's Karen's, but Bruh. with zombie sounds from Kyle. So, I really wanted Jason. Oh, Jason to be would this. love to watch this. I was gonna say sick metal rap. <laughs> oh my god. Bro, I wish I could do that. Oh my god, it's this guy. We we actually covered this. Yeah, I know we did. Yeah. I'm licking the door. I love this so much, man. Oh, this I love it too, man. Crazy. This Bro, I'm watching crazy. that on repeat later. That's funny as It's well. so great. Okay, so know. there's there's one more I wanna I wanna I can open it myself. Uh, there's one I wanna cover before we go into like a little bit of would you rather. All right, sure, whatever. Mm -hmm. So I was uh, I, I was scrolling the uh, the Reddit of of people of of Walmart, and I found this Joshua. Okay, some guy's name. I I wait. Oh, this was fu from fucking 2009. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. Yeah, there's not much. There's not much to do in Shawnee at 3:30 uh, a.m. But huffing in a Walmart bathroom really on the low list. Not for this guy. Joshu. Yeah. Uh, the channel 41 says Shawnee police arrested a 27 year old uh for a third time for huffing at the Walmart. Bro. You get you got arrested three times for huffing at the same Walmart within the last two months. Wow, that'll get he you banned from Walmart. Huffing? Huffing. He was puffing? No, huffing. huffing. He blew the Sn house down. Sniffing, sniffing glue. Oh, that's what huffing is? Yeah. Like, that's not even illegal, is it? Uh, I don't think so, no. I think he was just... I mean, he's using the products that are there, right? Is he using the products, or did he buy them already? No clue. <laughs> It's not necessarily indecent. illegal, but it's just indecent. It's very, yeah, it's indecent. Which, which I guess, an asshole. I guess you could be caught for public indecency. Basically. Yeah. yeah. All right. It's kind of, you know, it's kind of scuffed. All right. So would you rather? 
Would you rather have a clue in a Walmart bathroom or in a, in a, in a Walmart women's bathroom? I actually, I actually have one for this. Women's bathroom. And this one is one, <laughs> one that I thought of. Oh my god. Would, would you rather, <laughs> would you rather have a third leg where your penis is instead of a penis or a second penis but only one leg? A Dude, third. imagine that. <laughs> imagine how sensitive. If I have, if I had a penis leg, no, imagine... it's not a penis leg. It's it's just a normal leg, and you don't have a penis. No, I'm talking about. What's the point of living? A, I'm talking. About, <laughs> what, what do you mean? What's the point? I'm of? No, you said two penises, but oh, only yeah. one leg. Yeah. So I, so my mind was thinking that the that the penis was where the leg was, and it was the scale. No, so it was, was not thinking... to scale. <laughs> So I was no. thinking that the tip would be touching the ground, and I would have to get a special tip shoe and a fucking <laughs> urethra, a urethra plug to stop infection. No, no, it's not to the size. It's just another the same dick, copy and pasted it over, but no leg anymore. <laughs> it's oh. Control V. I, I, no, it's Control J. Control that's, that's called duplicate. Control okay. C, Control V. So I, I swear, like. What's what I call it? it? It's all. It's almost as if this is like a user preference thing. If your dick is small, why do you need another one? It's not. <laughs> it's not like some girl's gonna milk you like a fucking cow. Oh my as god. If you had udders. I like how I like how no one has mentioned, like, the scientific fact that there's no possible way for your ball sack to connect to that penis. Two pairs of balls too. No, you don't. It's only a Fuck. penis. <laughs> One ball for each penis. <laughs> One ball for each penis. <laughs> this is getting up bad. <laughs> Wait, that way you don't have to worry about testicular torsion. Which, by the no, way, no, you, it... you still do. No! Because yeah. it can tie around itself. Yeah. Wait, One, you one still, nut still can have... yeah. Totally one nut can still balls. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no. One, one, one nut can still tie around itself. Yeah. Like Sayori did? Oh my god. Yeah, it can tie itself. Dude, that was you know what you know what it, what you know what happens. Stop being a meanie. Just you know what happens if you get testicular torsion on only one testicle? That testicle decided that you should not allow to you should not be allowed to have children. That's what happened. Like it gained sentience, and he said, "Oh fuck no!" Like it pops out of your it pops out of your nutsack and and slaps you in the face and is like, "No." No babies. <laughs> Fuck you. It just forms a hand. Just... <laughs> Is that a hand or a hand-shaped penis? <laughs> Can we move on to the next question? Sure, yes. sure. <laughs> yes, I agree. We should move on. Would you rather have a third hand or a third foot? Third... Uh, is, is the third hand attached to a third arm? No. <laughs> like is it like Dan what Dan what do you think it is? It can be placed anywhere on your body, but it has like, no arm. Wait. Hand yeah. wait. I what think I would go with third hand because dude, of third dude, foot. I want I want a hand in the most inconvenient place. So <laughs> wait. no so wait, I'm gonna have it on one of my butt cheeks. So when someone tries to go grab my ass, I grab their hand instead. I, I was about to say, what if I put it right where my tailbone was, so I could just wipe with that hand? <laughs> but no arm. Yeah, no. And I just I just hand the toilet paper. I, I to have that yeah. Hand. I just hand the toilet paper to that hand, and I just use my fingers because my fingers are long. So it's just. You got well, the fucking wash that, if, I, if I had Jesus a third Christ. hand, I would actually put it on my back so I could actually scratch my back in like the most inconvenient spots. Yeah, but then you wouldn't, you, you, wouldn't, you wouldn't be able to lay back down. That's yeah, true. Ha having it, actually, to be fair. Well, here's the thing. If you had a third hand on your tailbone, how would you be able to really lie down comfortably? Well, if it's on my tailbone, then I can just, you know, the tail the tailbone <laughs> just, used to be a just tail. Just stick it in between the cheeks. What I, What's I could like... do, what I could do is I could just, like, set it out like a tail. And just sit down okay. with my hand just chilling in the back of the seat. Yeah, how uncomfortable would that be, uh, like on your back when you're lying down? Just, on like, your, you on your like... tailbone wrist. On my tailbone <laughs> wrist. What? I wonder if I would get RSI on that wrist as well. Oh my god. 
Wait, you know how like you can play guitar, uh, right? No. Like, some people do it behind their backs. So <laughs> that would actually be amazing for that. Wait, for, have uh, we, yeah. can, we haven't talked about the other option, which is which is a third foot. I I want a th- if I were to choose a third foot, I put it on my chest so I could do falling. So like I could fall down face forward, land on my chest foot, and just hop forward. Like a really cool imagine party trick. Imagine how good that, you could just kick how, people in the face. Imagine how good Wait, you'd be at the worm. I could, I could put it, I could put it on my on ankle, head. and then I could do a double kick without needing a double kick and just buy two single Shit. kicks. And just... Why would you need a double kick? If you put it on your chest, how? Drummer. Imagine how good you would be at the worm. That's true. That's true. Bruh. But then again. I don't think someone who's trying, some girl who's trying to run her hand down your chest, wants to see a foot. Yeah, <laughs> this kind of sticking out. So, what if you, if you put it on the top of your head, you could call yourself foot on head, and then if you put a shoe on it, you could call yourself shoe on head. That's like <laughs> you just become Soraka, but with a shoe on your fucking head. <laughs> Wait, this is a new sense of fashion. I'm just gonna Bruh. get I'm gonna get a styrofoam foot and attach it to a headband and just put a shoe on it. <laughs> <laughs> no. Alright. Tony, do you have any for us? No, I do not. I am my back just gave me a warning sign that I need to like lay the fuck down. Right, I swear, well, like my back is hands. my back is actually giving <laughs> my back is actually giving out on me or something. Um he, your back is saying that, goddamn, you're too much to carry. <laughs> um, Anymore? Uh, oh, wait. I got, I got one. I got one. All right, go ahead. This man. one's gotta be pretty cringeworthy. I just found this. Would you rather snort? You have to snort something. Would you rather snort ghost chili juices, or snort liquid nitrogen? Li- liquid nitrogen, dude. Liquid Easily. Nitrogen. Liquid nitrogen. So I could end my life. <laughs> Wait, actually, that would kill you. Yes. Wait. Both would kill you. Yes. I'll both the would beast. kill you. I'd rather uh, die with with cold. No, I'd rather die with a fucking chili pepper. What are you talking no. about? I, okay, I, I, dying in dying by freezing to death is one of the most peaceful ways to die. Because your body basically... Your brain freeze would be fucking ridiculous it would hurt for a li- it would hurt for a little bit but then it would be incredibly comfortable dude fuck that i'm gonna scream like a bitch uh, I'd rather well he does that in bed anyway <laughs> i have one yes i forgot i, I was an italian sub <laughs> <laughs> i have a question yeah would you rather have a permanent splinter under your big toenail or have a permanent bad haircut I mean, I already have the second one, so... Permanent bad haircut. Well, Eric, you just have a Jufro. <laughs> it, it gets better on certain days. Uh, on certain maybe... days, when it feels like being good, it'll be good. Yeah, it's like a dog, you know? Or a cat, more <laughs> like it. It's like a cat. You would know, you have two of each. <sighs> so, Dan, do you have, have one for us? Do I have one for you? Yeah. Like... Do I have to look this up or... Uh, uh, no, make one up. up. That's what I did. I have one. Go for it, Brandon. Would you rather fight a crocodile with a bow or an elephant with a shotgun? Okay, first oh, now, so... now, did the animal Crocodile with a bow, yeah. because how the hell is he going to use it with his tiny ass arms? Do I have to kill them? Yes. I just oh. take the bow. Take the bow, then use it and... You Shoot him that. in the rectum. <laughs> then say, oh, wait, would you rather fight a shotgun and you have the bow or fight an elephant and you have the shotgun? That is what, I'm fight not sure a what... shotgun? Wait, fight, fight a shotgun? shotgun? <laughs> you doing all right, Brandon? You tired? Don't worry, I'm clipping that later. Uh... <laughs> the Doom Slayer. Yeah, I'm taking the bow. Way, and you're just fighting crocodiles. I, 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 I'm taking the bow because I'm pretty sure my shot's accurate enough that I can just get it down their throat and they'll die internally. I'm pretty sure Shotgun. I could just sit 
on the crocodile's mouth because they don't have Good muscle shot, opening power and just stab him in the eye with the with the arrow. That's <laughs> graphic. That's not Oof. humane. It's not I'm humane. Shooting, I'm shooting in their mouth. No, oh, because shit. because because if you shoot it in their mouth, they have this like really fatty tongue, right? That like no, blocks. I'm shooting down their throat is what I mean. But they don't have a, a throat hole. Tony is the point. I, I'm shooting Look into up. their body. Okay, if you shoot Bruh. into their body, you might as well just turn them upside down and shoot at their heart. Yeah. Well, that's. It's gonna but be hard. Good to luck with that. You do realize. Yeah, exactly. I'm the... not gonna turn up. I'm not gonna. I, I want to. If, if, if I were to. If I were. If I were to kill an animal, it would be the most humane po way possible. But preferably, I just take the bow, run away, and say I won. <laughs> <laughs> What's it gonna do? Chase after me? I don't think so. You know What's what's it gonna scary? do? Chase after me with those little feet. You know what's scary? Crocodiles yeah, actually can crocodile. run pretty fast. I was gonna say I saw a video of some guy filming a crocodile. And it started approaching him, and then the guy stopped, started running, and then it started running after him, and it was it... keeping up with him. So here's Derek, the thing about run, running like, away really from a fast. So uh, yeah, that's true. But here's the thing about running away from a crocodile: you have to do it in a zigzag. They get very yeah, confused. They get they're like, "Wait, he's over there! No, he's over there! No, he's over there!" The <laughs> because his blind spot is right in the what center magic of his face. Is this? Uh, anyway, where did he go? But there he is. Nope, now he's over there. Is this good to know how? Or, or we could level. follow we could follow Steve Irwin's advice from um from South Park. I'm gonna go over there and stick my thumb up its ass. <laughs> <laughs> and I think on that note on do you think on that note we're gonna end? Maybe. Uh, let's do another Tony, it's well, not let's your do call. one last one. <laughs> That's true. I'm just trying to get better at segues. Dude, well, this, this fucking... This, this title shouldn't have been... Man, yeah. Tony sucks at segues. <laughs> well, That'll yeah, be the next something. episode. I have something. I have something. Yeah, go for it. Okay, go ahead, man. Would you rather fight a xenomorph or against a Yautja predator? Uh, predator. Xenomorph. It seems less painful. To die. If it's a predator... It seems less painful. They're just gonna kill me with a laser spear, and that's it. Yeah. I don't have Xenomorph anything. Where well, the aliens kill. is gonna like fucking capture you, impregnate you. Yeah, impregnate like, me. Out. If that's you're crazy. very unlucky, yeah. You'll be like a part of the hive for like a few. I have like, a, really, a day before you die. I have a really gross one. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Would you rather ovulate? While still having a penis, right? Or would you rather have boobs, but instead of milk, it's semen? <laughs> oh I'm taking the, the semen boobs. Uh, tits with semen. <laughs> I am disgusted. <laughs> I'm taking the tits with semen. However, oh, every se every me. single time a baby cries, they dribble. <laughs> Just like Wait, milk boobs. Every single time, what happens? They dribble. Do you don't? Do you? Did you not know that? No, you no, you cut out. What? I said yeah. every single time a baby cries, they dribble as if you were an impregnated woman. Dude, that would suck. What? Yeah. It's like fuck. that it's like happens. The, if if it's, just, if it's a woman, like you're yeah, it's like you're at the store, right? And then your 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 fucking daddy, mommy milkers are are fucking <laughs> like. <laughs> I was taking a drink of water, you son of a bitch. <laughs> it's like they're uncontrollably. Like, Oozing cum, and you're like, what the fuck? Why is your shirt wet? Why is why it is also it? sticky? That like, you know, you know that happens, right? You know that happens, right? Oh. So what happens is, if a woman decides to breastfeed, right? Um, if she decides to breastfeed, and after pregnancy, and she hears a baby crying in public, even if it's not her own baby. She will start lactating. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. Interesting human biology. <laughs> that must fucking suck. It must suck. I'm glad I don't have boobs. <laughs> Why do you say them like Eric Cartman from South Park? Beebs. 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 Beebs.
Meh, my cat. Yeah. No, kitty, this is my pet pet. <laughs> Mate, right, took our jabs. All right. Took our jabs. Anyone want to do one last one that's not incredibly disgusting and gross? Yeah, that was funny. Yeah. <clears throat> I have you. one. All right, last go one. ahead, Brandon. I have a pretty serious one. You know, oh, okay. my God. Okay. Uh, would you rather be rich but have or and but have a shitty life and be severely depressed or be um have just enough to get by and uh have a you're leaving us on the edge here brandon hello brandon yeah i'm here you didn't you, finish your you statement you didn't finish your statement <laughs> um i did no, you didn't. We didn't hear it. Would you rather be out. rich no, no, and out. have severe depression or be poor and have a very happy life? Uh, be poor, poor and happy. Poor and happy. Poor and happy. Poor and happy. Because I can always gain more money. True. Or the alternative answer job. is... The alternative answer is rich in depression, but because I will have a, a crippling hentai addiction to fall back on... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, and all the money, happy. all the money in the world to source that addiction. Yep, but I'm yeah, not well, doing literally... that because because that sounds horrible. I would not want that. <laughs> Just imagine Tony in a rehab center. So what are you here for? I have anti. a crippling like, anti addiction. <laughs> <laughs> too many, too many I'm cat an girl sister. tales. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, a lot the doctor's just like, so what are you here for? And Tony's just like, I'm an Ari simp. I'm an Ari simp. <laughs> I'm an Ari man. Uh, he is bad, man. <laughs> He's like, oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. We have, like, two others in the other room. If you want to go way, talk to Fox them about scrolls, it, you can. Uh, <laughs> Fox um, scrolls are better than cat girls. Did you say fox scrolls are better than cat girls? Yes, yes. he did. Okay, well... Hey. That, I, that I, Ari is a fox that. girl. <laughs> yeah, Ari is a fox girl. She's a kitsune, a nine-tailed fox. She's also a succubus. And I, I, we had this discussion life. before. She's, not, te not, not, she's technically, technically a succubus, but that's because a succubus is defined in the nature of what a kitsune is. Yep. You. It's like saying... It's like saying... This is an apple fruit, and then you're telling me it's a fruit. Like that's <laughs> that's what you just said. I have my moments. I have like I have a question like uh that I want to ask you like uh yeah. what would you think is the worst fictional universe to live in? No, you cannot say Warhammer 40k since that's designed to be a shitty fictional universe. Warhammer oh. 40k. Gotcha. <laughs> Honestly. Legend of Korra, because, uh, no, because my dude. destiny relies on a girl whose rage dude, <laughs> may not be clutched. So much. Yo, no, think of this. The, no, the Hunger Games universe. Actually. Oh, yeah, Legend, yeah. You know what? You know what? And what else? I, I think uh, the worst universe to live, the worst fictional universe to live in would actually be the Dragon Ball universe, because you're under constant threat of your entire universe just getting blown up. Because That's just some any kind of anime. Fight someone. I would That's say. Not actually, any anime. I would it's say. A lot of animes. So. I would say specifically. Yeah, but I, I'd say Dragon Ball in particular because, like, your entire, like, your entire fate revolves around this one guy who wants to beat people up. So I just realized, Tony, you may or may not agree with this. League of Legends would be an awful universe to live in. There's literally conflict everywhere. There, I, I would love to live in the League of Legends there, universe. There is no nation except for Ishtal, I think, that does not have a war or some type of conflict going on at the moment. Yeah, but Tony will get to follow Ari around all day. No, that's not even Ishtal. That's in a... It, she, she's she's going to Bilgewater, which means she, she's... She's been dying. But I'd I'd follow her to Bilgewater. Dude, Bilgewater seems awesome. Bilgewater must smell like shit. I don't care. <laughs> it's because of Bell Delphine. 
Why don't we see all these How? places? The only place we ever see in League of Legends is fucking Summoner's Ryan. Rift. Ryan. Go to the universe page and you get to see all these places. Uh, okay. Brandon, if you want to know about the lore of League of Legends, go to League of Legends Universe. They have a map, they have all the story, they have all the lore, everything. Uh... <laughs> if you don't, and you just want to complain about it being a PvP game, you you can just do that. Anyways, um... <laughs> I'm not <laughs> Universe 11... <laughs> I'm not arguing about your opinion, I'm arguing about your ignorance. Eric, 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 yeah. Eric, this is us right now. Uh, can, can, uh... No, the water, the water, when, water when you post something sick, super though. controversial and go to bed immediately... <laughs> um, Peach just sent me something. Kelly. Oh boy. Nico, Nico, kneecaps. Nico, 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 Oh, god damn it. Nico, Nico, Nico. What is this, Tanya Harding? Nico, Nico, Nico. Dude, I'm gonna break your Nico Nico kneecap. I'm gonna break your Nico Nico kneecap. Hold on. I know. I look at the chat. All I see is floppy disk. The gangsta way of storing them files. Actually, what? I, mean, I I have some blank floppies. Blank or floppies. <laughs> The Activating cum, cum house. So <laughs> <laughs> Whoops, you need to put the CD one. into your computer. Blank floppies. <laughs> I, that's... Can we get another... Can we get another t-shirt design for that? <laughs> Blank floppies. And all it is, is it's a floppy disk. And, like, the marker pen, blank on top, floppies on bottom. And then it's the floppy disk, but on the place where you write it, it's just a floppy dick. It's... <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> anyway. Alright, guys, I want you to say your last words for the podcast. <laughs> Thank you! Thank you! Great last words! Alright, go ahead. Say your last words for the podcast. Wait, last words? Yeah, last words. We're finishing up. All right, Thanks for watching. Am I about to be executed? Yes, you're about to be executed, Brandon. There's a sniper trained at your head right now. <laughs> what say, Ori? It's either you or, or Yuri. You have to choose. Uh, me. Okay, that's... Kill me. No. Brandon, say your last words for the podcast. I want to play a game. Thank you, Dan. Um, my last words for the podcast. Uh, hmm. can, Don't do drugs, kids. Ryan, can you? Or you'll end up doing what we're doing. <laughs> Ryan, can you clip that? That like thirty. Yeah, second, well, it... Can you clip that thirty-second moment where I said, "Hey, do you have any last words?" And it's just him. Um. And oh, yeah. and okay. and then title. Yeah, well, drugs are so bad. And then, then title it. Work? Then title it, right? Title the clip. Um, title the clip. Trying to end the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Ryan. Last words. Well, he man. Ryan. Last words. <laughs> um. Thank you very much, Tony. Last words. I hate you. All right, cool. <laughs> Thank you, Dan. Last words. I didn't even say anything. <laughs> thanks, yeah, thanks for coming. For those who came out to the podcast, thank you so much uh, yeah, for listening to our bullshit. Basically, we, could, we wouldn't be here without you guys. Let's be we, real. We were we were talking out of our ass this entire time, except for when we were in segments. I wasn't. Even then, I wasn't. I was just casually farting. There's a difference. <laughs> God damn it! Uh, all right. Thank you. For I haven't said anything. Dan, you've been interrupting this whole time. I think you've said enough. <laughs> I did not say it. Not... <laughs> Let's go. Dan, go ahead. Thank you, Dan. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank you all for joining us on the podcast. If you're watching on YouTube, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, you will always have a home right here by the hearth. Check out our playlists.